hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Vivian and for if you're new, welcome here in my crafty room. Um, for today I have another unboxing from Diamond Art Club. I recently bought four diamond paintings and I already uh, unboxed them all. If you have missed them, please go watch in my uh, unboxing playlist, they're all there. But uh, a while ago, uh, around Easter, I guess, I did a huge pre-order of six diamond paintings and four of them came in lately, recently. Um, and they're here now. So, we're going to unbox them. I picked just one out of the box, so I don't know what one it is. So, shall we see? Because I am excited for all of those. So, today we got... Ooh, Kitchen Helpers from Randall Spangler. This is actually my first Randall Spangler uh, Diamond Art Kit. And uh, I really hope that it's something I like because I've never tried it, so I don't know. But I think the dragons or the draglings, I don't know how you like to call them, look really cute to me. And I didn't want to do just a random uh, Randall Spangler uh, kit that doesn't mean like anything, but I love being in the kitchen and doing such things as cooking and baking. So I thought this was the kit for me to try out if I like this style. Because like I said, I've never tried it. So let's get into the box. A canvas, a toolkit, a sticker, and I guess it looks like it has something more. But I'm not sure. No, that was the box is empty. Also, excuse my vacuum in the background. So we have a small sticker. You can put it on the side of the box. So when you store them um, on their sides, you know what one it is, but you can also use it for in your diamond painting journal or for other things you like. Um, before the toolkit, we have on the sticker, we have all the information. So the name is Kitchen Helpers and the artist is Randall Spengler. Then we have the image, the diamond shape is square. And the size is 56 by 69 centimeters. Excuse me. For all the sounds in the background. So then we have the toolkit. This is a square toolkit. It's just a basic toolkit with uh, sharp tweezers, a diamond painting pen, a grippy, a clear boat with a funnel, two plates of heart shaped wax and some baggies and I believe there's a multi plater but I'm not seeing or feeling it. But there's supposed to be a multi plater. Oh wait a sec, I feel it. And usually it's a four placer so I'm assuming it's a four placer. So then we have the canvas. I love the look of the dust sleeve. Just the branding. I love it. I just love their logo. Get it out of out the back and then we'll see what the canvas looks like. Let's move that to the side. And if you have never had a Diamond Art Club canvas before, you probably don't understand this, but the canvas itself is so soft. Like you can pet your diamond painting for like three hours, but that's not what we are here for. So, the diamonds. 
we have then. Oh no, what happened? No, 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 no. Well, here we have the instruction booklet, which we don't need because we know how to diamond paint. But what happened here? Well, you can see the stickers are pre-cut, which is amazing. But the stickers got smushed and cropped and stabbed inside the diamond painting. And the diamonds. So, again, here we have the picture and all the details here and below. I think that it's gorgeous. I can't wait to see the canvas. So, the sticker is pre cut, really helpful when you're kidding up or kidding down. You want it to go fast. Diamonds, let's put them on the side for a moment. And then, what I want to do is. Um, Rolling the canvas backwards because it's port glue and you can roll port glue backwards and I do this because oh wow that way it will lay flatter um, much quicker because I'm not that patient to wait until it lays flat out of itself. And oh my oh my oh my I'm already in love with it. Are you ready? There it is. Oh wow, oh wow, oh wow, oh wow. So, what do we see on the canvas is um, a, um, how it is called, like a jar and it says chocolate syrup. Never had chocolate syrup before, but it's fine. Then we have a bottle with honey. A recipe box, a book, some chocolate chip cookies, a pot with sugar and a pot with flour. And here we have some books. I think they are um, like, how do you call it? Recipe books. And here in the background we see all the uh, pans or skillets, just like how you like to call them. And um, I think this is on like, um, the, the, how do you call it? Shelter? No, it's not a shelter. Counter. Counter. Uh, this like at the counter, I guess, and behind the books, there's like uh, the, the stove. Do you call it a stove? I think so, the place where you cook your meals. And here we have the pot or, or bowl, my English guys. I'm so sorry. I hope you guys understand what I'm what I'm saying. But um, I I guess they're making like a cookie butter in the bowl to make the chocolate chips because here we see the chocolate chips, so they can make chocolate chip cookies out of it and I think this is so cute and I'm so excited but I say this with every unboxing but I love all them yes and which I think is a really nice detail is all the um they're not emeralds but uh, like not diamonds but like the, the the stones in the book just all the detailing it's so Perfect, and here like the dragons in the bowl, so cute. So we're going to see uh, all the drills. I'll put a timestamps in the description box. So if you don't want to see all the colors of the diamonds, you can skip to that time in the video. And then we'll talk about um, more detailing colors and um, especially the AB. So we'll see where the AB drills go. So right now, I'm going to um, get the diamonds out of their bag and uh, then we'll see what the colors in this kit are. So now the diamonds are out of their bag. 
Um, we'll go see what DMC codes we have and how many ABs there are and what ABs there are. Um, if I see on the legend, which is here on the top left, but also at the bottom right, uh, I see there are 51 colors, including two uh, AB drills um, or AB colors. Uh, you know it's an AB when it's um, below 150. So um, 150 and higher are the regular DMC codes and lower than that, you know, it's ABs. At least it works this way for Diamond Art Club. I don't know how it works for other diamond painting companies. Um, we have three strips, one with a large amount of uh, diamonds in them, some with a bit of less diamonds in them and with not so much diamonds in it. So we're going to start with the biggest strip, a strip of the biggest amount and I'm sorry if you're not a fan of the crinkling plastic but first up we have the 377 and we have two bags of 355, we have two bags of 3865 we have two bags of 3853. Let's get all through. We have two bags of 938, 977, 600. Two bags of 3371. These, these look like they are black, but they're actually a really dark brown. The darkest brown there is in the MC. Uh, 915, 3854, 996, 775, a really gorgeous mint green, 895, and 3327. So this was the first trip of diamonds. And we'll go to the next one. Oh, this is starting good, guys. So this is an AB drill. This is AB 136 and you see that shine, the sparkle they do. So this is an Aurora Borealis drill. It's the iridescent coating that is put on the drills so they will shine brighter and sparkle more than the regular drills. It's just gorgeous. It's like a dark blue but some people call it like purple and that's completely fine with me but in my opinion it's more like blue and oh my it shines so excited for this to see where they go so let's move on 905 3855 3860 3890 995 356 815, 3837, 317, two bags of 720, two bags of 890, and we have 301, and two bags of 898, 3830, and 3843. Gorgeous colors. Then we move on to the last strip with all the least amount of diamonds. And we start right off with 3608. And we have 3607, 718, 209, 3755, 602, 208, 310. Is this all the 310? I love that because tree pen is not my cup of tea. 907, 33336. Looks like black too, but it's a really dark blue, dark navy kind of color. 498, 321, 165, 318, 601. 779, which is a milk chocolate color, 400, 134, so here we have another AB, 
today sparkle so bright so like shine bright like a diamond no i'm not going to sing just here to show you the gorgeous sparkle of the drills so let's move on 900 and 904 so these were all the diamonds i'm going to put them back in their bags and then we'll see where the ab's go in the kits well, it took me a while, but the diamonds are all back in their bags. Um, they weren't so much, so it went a little easier than the last time with my um, Brookside Retreat by Chuck Pinson. Um, so, let's see where the ABs go. Um, if we see the schematic legend thing on the side, we see our first AB is the green one which was 134 and on the canvas it's symbol number one so we're going to look for the ones and uh, let's see here we have like five in the bottom of the jar pot thing here we have here in the uh, in the, the round brand i don't know end of the the, the plate then we have it here all kind of sort of outlining the little cute dragon and here all in the nose and with the other one it's just exactly the same um let's see some here in the the, the stone thing some there and some there and i guess that was that was it oh, some here um, so now let's move on to the second one, which is diamond number 136 and on the canvas that is uh, symbol number two. And then we have here the, the, the outlining of the lid. Um, what do we have more? All here, like the shadow in from the draggling on the uh, sugar pot here in the, the lid um, let's see I would have done some in their eyes too but maybe I'll do that later when I have some left we have here also in the out in the shadow on the flower pots also here some in the lid and I guess I watch it because there weren't so much ABs in the bags. And I think it looks gorgeous. At first I have my doubts about this painting because I've never tried a Randall Spangler, but I don't think Randall would let me down because oh my, oh my, oh my, I think I have a new addiction. But we'll never know, we'll never know. Some parts of the canvas are color blocking some parts are a little confetti, not that much, but a little like all the, the scales of the dragons. And uh, here are the cookies and a bit of the counter, but not that much though. Some parts of um, like here, the recipe box, um, also here a bit in the book, so here a bit. But not that much confetti, pretty much is uh, like color blocking. So uh, it looks great and I'm so excited to do this one. But um, my stash is growing. I still have to unbox three and uh, there are five more on the way. So um, I have too many tricks. So that was it for today. I really hope you guys like this canvas as much as I do and are as much as excited as I am. Um, I'm really uh, curious to know if you have this one in your stash, so if you do, please leave a comment down below. Um, also, please leave if you don't have this in your stash and um, you're excited about it. Just uh, let me know how you think about this diamond painting and then I will see you guys in the next unboxing. Bye-bye!